Bard represents the finest of an American tradition of higher education, which has catapulted the American University into the premier spot in the world. This is an institution that truly believes that education can change the world, and we can make commitments to that every day, believing in the transformative power of education to make better citizens. I don't think there is a more effective or more practical preparation for today's students than the broad foundation and the interdisciplinary approach to the liberal arts that one finds at Bard or at Simons Rock. My name is Steven. Um, I'm from Guangdong, China. I'm studying math and computer science at Bard. The advantage of studying in a small liberal art college is, you know, you first of all, you won't get lost because the community is really small and safe and everything is so accessible. You get to be very close to the members of the community, including the faculty and the students. And you get to enjoy very small lecture size and you talk to the professors much more often than people in a big research university. Students who go to liberal arts colleges like Bard tend to spend a lot of time interacting closely with other scientists, whether those are other students or with their professors. Um, and it's that, it's that immersion in doing science all the way through for all students that makes a liberal arts environment really unique. Bard has a saying that a place to think. It gives students a very good environment. I'm Sean, and I graduated from Bard in 2011 with a major in violin and Chinese. I chose Bard because of the unique program that allowed me to do music, violin performance, and another major in the college. The main distinguishing feature of Bard is that uh, unlike some fine universities and liberal arts colleges in the United States, uh, the arts have an important place. So if one is a musician, for example, here you can do both. You can get a first-class training equal to Curtis Juilliard or Eastman, any great conservatory, and also finish a degree in mathematics and biology and English. And in a five-year period, you can open more than one career path. My name is Ke Rendong. Uh, I'm now in my uh, yeah, and I love Bard. <laughs> Bard is the place where you can meet lots of intellectually and culturally diverse people. And after talk to them, you can gain lots of different ideas where you've never had outside this campus. And you're going to be much more open-minded after going to Bard. So Bard is a really global place, right? So students come from all over the world to study here, and then they do projects that actually, in some cases, take place in different parts of the world. And then they go back to those different parts of the world, sometimes for graduate study or to continue their, uh, their career, whether that's in science or in something else. So we really think of ourselves as a global institution. Through the experiences that Bard students have here, not just in the classroom, but their research experiences, their extracurricular um, experiences, they have the opportunity to learn how to engage in independent inquiry, how to solve and tackle problems themselves, to go out into the world and approach the things that they need to do in the real world with the skills that they learned here in the college. A great university education is not about really what you know, but about the skills and the capacity you have to frame questions and answer them, and to um, put information together and to create new information. It's skills which really adapt to a competitive and changing world. Our students will be living in a world where they're working across nations, across cultures. The challenges that they face in their working lives will transcend disciplinary boundaries and national borders. The education that our students are receiving prepares them to adapt, to learn, to change, and to continue to find success throughout their careers. So after graduating from Bard, I will be assistant brand manager at Unilever, um, and I will be doing advertisement for global campaigns. After my time at Bard College, I decided I should go to a grad school in computer science. And I think Bard really helped me with um, rediscovering myself and, and in the meantime shaping my own personality in, in making this decision. Yeah, I feel Bard has prepared me very well for a career in music and playing the violin, which is something I plan on doing for the rest of my life. So now that I've graduated from Bard, I'm playing more than ever. Uh, in fact, I'm here right now in New York City rehearsing for a concert. 
I would encourage people to look at Bard because it promotes independent thinking, creativity, and the pursuit of what you think is important.